my beloved love, it is typified by wholeness. There is nothing within you that would cause the divine to turn away from you, not even those parts of you that may fill you with fear, shame, guilt or regret. You are so loved. Can you take refuge in this knowledge? Feel it, not only as an idea, nourishing as that is, but as a visceral reality. Allow yourself to feel the peace and receive healing. This unconditionally loving energy is not limited to the one bearing its name, but is shared by Rumi and many other holy ones. So, that feels like a beautiful place to close this reading. Again, I will now be heading over to Patreon for the extended reading. The link to that is under the video. Otherwise, I am sending you all so much love. The reading was very interesting because a divine masculine came out at the beginning of the reading, but then it almost felt as though they were being put on the back burner and a divine feminine came through very strongly, very much embodying the Empress kind of energy. So if you were connecting with that first reading, I am going to be channeling some more details about this interconnection between you as the divine feminine and the divine masculine that was coming out in that first reading. As I'm shuffling, allow me to introduce myself to those of you who are new here. Welcome. If you are new, my name is Infinity, and this is Magnetize Yourself, where we talk about life, love, spirituality, and of course, the law of attraction. In today's video, we're going to be doing a deep dive into that interconnection between a divine feminine and divine masculine that came out in that first reading. Okay, so the first card here is doubt in the reversed position. This particular divine masculine energy was doubting your connection in the past. I just got this sudden restless feeling, so I feel as though they are feeling very restless themselves but it's because they're suddenly feeling certain about something. So this masculine is someone who was doubting something in the past, doubting something between the two of you. But now, a lot is changing because we have the change card in the upright position, and also loneliness reversed and honesty upright. So this is a masculine who's coming off as a very lone wolf kind of archetype someone who may spend a lot of time alone or on his own, someone who might not be in a committed relationship or connection. But when it comes to you, Divine Feminine, although he doubted this connection at first, something has happened to cause him to realize that there's something here. And I use those words intentionally because for this specific Divine Masculine I am channeling into here, I feel as though he might not know exactly what to call this connection. He might not be familiar with the concept of soulmates or twin flames or really be that interested in spirituality in general. But what he might say is, there is just something here that I can't deny. From Divine Muscular Type yes, if you believe. <laughs> 